Top 12 Least Wanted Backyard Birds Despite the fact that the house sparrow is declining in its native Eurasian range, this bird is invasive in many areas around the world. It can be aggressive and will kill other birds in order to usurp their nesting cavities, which can severely endanger native birds. Using the proper bird house entrance hole sizes is a good way to help discourage house sparrows, as is eliminating open feeding areas. These noisy birds often travel in large flocks that can quickly empty a feeding area, leaving nothing for more desirable birds to enjoy. In North America, European starlings are considered invasive, but they can easily be discouraged from feeders by using smaller perches or caged feeder designs that will keep them from accessing the feeding ports. Blocking nesting sites can also keep these birds away. Vultures can be interesting birds to see, but they're not always welcome in the yard because they can be messy and intimidating. Black vultures also have a reputation for inquisitive damage and will pick rubber pieces off vehicles or cause other damage to property. It is best to discourage these carrion-eating birds from backyard roosts by using sound deterrents or making perches less vulture-friendly. Many birders enjoy the company of woodpeckers, but when those woodpeckers begin damaging wood siding or drumming loudly on different surfaces, they are suddenly less welcome. Covering attractive surfaces is one way to discourage woodpecker damage, and if necessary, avoiding suet feeders or nuts that woodpeckers love can make these birds less likely to stay nearby. Common grackles are gregarious birds with voracious appetites for grain, including birdseed. In rural areas, they often damage crops, and because they can gather in tremendous flocks they can be considered quite the nuisance. Removing ground feeding areas and offering foods other than birdseed are easy ways to discourage common grackles from your yard. While the glossy plumage of the brown-headed cowbird can be attractive, their status as a brood parasite is less than attractive to many backyard birders. These birds lay their eggs in other birds' nests, and the foster parents often neglect their own hatchlings to care for their unwittingly adopted chick. Avoid feeding birds cracked corn or low-quality birdseed to help discourage brown-headed cowbirds. Homes near waterways or with generous water features may become hosts to Canada geese, but these large waterfowl can be messy and aggressive, particularly during the summer breeding season or when the birds are molting. Many urban and suburban areas have plans to control populations of Canada geese, including regular culling, and if these birds are a problem in your yard it is best to contact the proper wildlife control officials. Mallards become a problem in yards with ponds when they hybridize with unwanted Easter ducklings and their populations grow out of control. They can even become accustomed to using backyard pools, leaving foul water behind. Making a backyard pond less duck-friendly by adding taller plants around its edge can help discourage these birds, as can avoiding ground-feeding areas where ducks can more easily forage. Rock pigeons are another bird species that is invasive in much of the world, and these doves can be aggressive and demanding in their large flocks. Choose feeders with smaller perches or avoid offering mixed birdseed to discourage rock pigeons from visiting. Another good step is to use pigeon deterrent methods such as spikes to eliminate perches on gutters or fences so these birds won't have a place to feel comfortable. Many dedicated backyard birders prefer not to host to birds of prey that will feed on their favorite finches, sparrows, and other songbirds. While Cooper's hawks are protected birds, it is possible to discourage them from the yard by providing ways to protect backyard birds from hawks. Without a reliable food source, the raptors will move on to easier hunting grounds. A smaller cousin of the Cooper's hawk, the sharp-shinned hawk is another backyard raptor that can be discouraged if it doesn't have other birds to prey upon. Build a brush pile to provide safe shelter for smaller backyard birds and this accipiter will eventually leave to find a better, more productive place to hunt for its next meal. Wild turkey is a popular bird in November, but rarely is it very popular at feeders because of its aggression and its gregarious behavior that causes it to travel in large, hungry flocks. These can be powerful birds and it is best to avoid having them as regular guests. Removing ground feeders or large, low tray feeders will help encourage these heavyweight, polygamous birds to seek a better territory to explore. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more interesting videos.
and please hit the like button for the YouTube algorithm.